today I'd like to talk about the new Korg Mini Log. Very hot keyboard. It's what everybody's been asking for. Well, I want a polyphonic synth, not just one note, but four notes possible, and then you can just stack them up when you want your big sounds. The other cool feature is the way it looks. It has beautiful brushed aluminum, but also has a back wood panel. You get this real old retro analog look to it and a sound that goes with that. It's sort of that in-between where it's not quite full size, which means it's a little bit lighter, a little bit smaller to carry around. It has the great look with all the knobs, and so you can touch move faders, move sliders, move knobs to get any sound that you want. Change the attack slightly. Change it continuously as you solo so you have a very musical performance. So also with pitch bender, control of course, and the same size keys as the Korg's reissue of the ARP Odyssey. So you can take any single sound and turn it into a four note, I want to play brass chords. You can have two note where it's a little bit fatter. or I want those big bass sounds or big soaring lead sounds all in unison with every oscillator pointing into one note. You do have a built-in sequencer, step sequencer built in. The other coolest thing as you stare down at the, the synth itself, there's an oscilloscope. So you're actually looking at the waveform that you're playing, be it a sawtooth or a triangle wave or a sine wave. The biggest knob is the cutoff filter knob, and you can see on the panel, bigger than all of the others. So easy to find, even in the dark on stage, you can just go for the cutoff filter and right to the left of it is your resonance control. So you can have these big sweeping filter effects. You can store your presets as a great beginning point and you have 200 of those to begin with, so more than one ever needs. The Korg Minilog, great analog, polyphonic, programmable. It's the retro, but it's new. It's hot.